Hello everyone and welcome to First Ian Impressions with Insane Ian. I am Insane Ian and this is Blue Estate the Game, which uh, is based on a comic by Victor, Victor Kalachev or something close to that. Uh, so uh, it's a first person shooter, but apparently you actually use your controller uh, to shoot. Point at the screen with your wireless controller and press L1 or up button to center the crosshair. Uh, that's neat. I didn't expect to do that. So we're doing that. Uh, pointing at the screen. Oh my gosh. It's, it's the motion of the controller. Okay. Okay. I stood up to do this. This was this was a dumb idea. Okay then. So yeah, this is based on a comic book. The comic book itself is rather bawdy and full of stereotypes. Um, but it's interesting. It's a crime drama. Uh, I don't know if it's set in the 2000s or not. But, uh... It's the Russian mob versus the Italian mob, so that's totally a thing. So we're gonna see how this... Put the subtitles on, because I'm turning the music down. Put this at 50. But yeah, I have to point the controller at... and we'll see how that does. I'm standing up in my living room. This will be fun. Alright, so we're gonna go to story mode. So I can't do arcade, it's not lit up. Alrighty. <laughs> Hello, PS1 addict, and welcome to whatever the hell this is. Yes, this is a nice thing to stumble into. Uh, like I said, this is based on a comic book. Uh, this art here is better than the comic book. Anyway, let's... This is motion controlled with the PS4 controller. I don't understand, I'm going to have to point the controller at people to shoot them. Fine, we'll do it, here we go. Uh, no, solo, so we're doing solo. And we're doing normal difficulty. Here we go, okay. Reload, shoot, switch weapon, back, validate. Gesture with a swipe, oh god. This is gonna be Warning, the following statements by private investigator Roy Devine Jr. are currently under an investigation, and a resemblance to real situations or real persons, living or mostly dead, is purely coincidental. But don't worry, the authorities know you paid good money for this game and will fact check all statements for maximum customer satisfaction. I paid $3 for this game on sale on PSN. If you didn't pay good money for this game, the authority knows that too, so watch your step, punk. Alright, I paid bad money for it. We'll figure this out. Victor Kalvachev's Blue Estate. I feel like we're gonna get a, a comic book style cutscene. Yeah. They say nobody walks in the city of angels, but she had legs that went all the way down to the sidewalk and up the stairs to my office. She rolled inside like the morning fog, moist and mysterious. Jesus, right. The one look in her eyes, and I knew things would be heating up fast. I said, what do I call you? And she answered, Cherry Pops? Okay. Cherry Pops is a side character in the comic. Roy's kind of the main character. Leaving Cherry with a broken heart, the kind of deep aching void on the good kind of why did you beep yourself? We're, we're all adults here. And the closer I got to my client, Cherry, the deeper the mystery got. See, Cherry danced and mopped up Sunset Strip Joe and called the Smoking Barrel. Yes. And her boss, Tony, was the one and only son of Don Luciano. Yes! Okay, well, I will pick point and pound the volume. Thank you for letting me know about the echo. Oh, right. I thought I handled that problem last time. Skills come to the attention of Kim Bong and Jim Bong Sick, proprietors of an even shadier LA flesh. Is the echo better now? So when the smoke and barrels top stripper disappeared one night, Tony Luciano knew just where to look. Okay. This is 
different from the comic. Yay, much better. On Tony's view of the world to the sights of his gun. He'd given him the nightclub to run to get him back on the high road. But Kim Bong Sik had kidnapped my client Cherry Pops. The only human Tony Luciano had ever warmed up to. And Tony couldn't even spell negotiation. This seems... Alright, swipe on the touchpad. Cool. Alright, any one of you that speaks a word of English, tell them loopy twins you work for that I'm here for what's mine. Yay! I said immediately racist. Oh, this desert eagle's gonna say it louder. One, two. <laughs> Diplomacy and tolerance weren't. Yeah, Tony's an idiot in the comics, and he's just as much an idiot in the game. Hooray! He wasn't much for questions. You hear me now? <laughs> I need more hair gel. So my hair gets in my way. That's a thing that'll happen. Hold the controller in a comfortable position and press L1 or the up button. So that's good. But for so Tony, I can recenter it. His own call for stealth and deduction, and all Tony had were a lot of bullets. I'm uh, accidentally hitting all of these mooks. Okay, the animated coin icon is important. And his fear is on he will hit next. As soon as it flashes, the enemy will hit. Cool. Oh, cool, I get picked up a health thing. Yeah, the headshot response time's not great. Hey, you guys are still doing stuff and you didn't hear the gunfire in the other room. Former employed by the state senate, bra size 32k. Well, alright. Holy crap. Her back must be killing her. Also, she's not in the comic either. She's about to fall into the tank because of her boobs. Well, that's cool. It's kind of got a little bit of a, of a lock-on moment. Ah, guns need bullets. Combo was broken. Oh, L if I hold R L2, I, I suddenly am playing Time Crisis. So aim, actually aiming with the controller is not terrible, it's slightly difficult. If you notice, that when I move it, it like gets a little bit of a lock on. Uh, the hair is in the face. You notice the, uh, the little red crosshairs pop up. Give me a second to reload, I'm gonna put a hole in your head. Combo broken, give me the health. Oh cool, I can duck. Warning headshot, what, what the hell's a warning headshot? Oh, he dodged it. Alright, you know what? Am I diving through the air? Is that what's happening here? 
<laughs> Holy crap, this is garbage. Oh, geez, I'm out again. Christ. How many bullets do I have? How many clips did I walk into this club with? I already swiped my hair out of the way. That's a dumb mechanic to have in a game. This is lame. Give me a second to reload, I'll give you a turn off. Okay, so I have slid. Shoot slow mo. Tony is not this good a shot in the game. I mean, in the comic. Tony's an idiot in the comic. This trig is giving me a blister here. Okay, well this was a thing. Jerry! Give me a noise, baby, says so I can get to where you are. Alright, I'm grabbing health. Now I'm getting steam. Taking a door open. At least this dump has a bar. Ah, I couldn't shoot that. Swipe on the touch bag, you want the projectile to be thrown. You call that service? Okay. Yeah, it's time crisis. Carefully choosing shots. I just reload? Doing a lot of headshots, more than I would expect to do in a game that All would right. do this. Next round's on me. Come on, I'm trying to shoot the lucky cat. Damn it. Ah, bullets. Bullets are needed for shooting people. Oh, can well, I get that? <laughs> and now I have a shotgun. Yeah, this is just a rail shooter. I'm not moving myself. I. Oh shit, my cover can dis dissolve. Okay, I think I'm almost out of bullets. I'm out of bullets, huh? Well, why am I only putting one bullet in at a time? Oh, I gotta hold it down to reload it all the way. That's kind of stupid. Cool. Wet floor sign, huh? Yeah, you'd actually have to clean this place to get it. Wait. And I slip. Yeah, that's that's about how Tony is. Oh, I'm supposed to swipe up to shut the door. Trying to trying to shoot him instead. Cause why would why wouldn't I be shooting him in this sequence? Oh, well, there's a dude hey, taking a shit. A what are you looking at? Damn it. 
I'm trying to shoot the uh, ammo, but it's not like a regular shooter. You have to swipe to get the ammo. Not like I'm running out of ammo or anything. Oof. Smells like steamed vegetables in here. We have disabled smells for your convenience. Thank you, game! There he is. What's your deal, man? It's on rails. Not really a whole lot of redeeming factor to this game. It's only kind of point and shoot. Hey, this, is supposed to be a place for relaxation. this is just killing a whole bunch of dudes. I do enjoy the uh the holding down for reload, that's kind of realism. But really, pointing to, to shoot doesn't really do anything with it. The time crisis elements of hiding behind stuff is, is nice, though. But I'm only saying that because I really love time crisis. This game wishes it was as good as time crisis. Okay. I've decided to sit down now, and it still hasn't changed anything. shoot open the big glass thing that the girl is in. See if that'll actually bust her out. Ow! So because of that, How many times I gotta reload this thing? I apparently gotta reload it a lot. I love my head. Ah, I missed the... Having to shoot and swipe and... At least because it's a clip, I don't have to reload every bullet every single time. She's still alive. I tried to break the thing to get you out. Keep your head up, doll. I got bigger fish to fry right now. Okay, health. Oh, where all the use come from? Come on. Get a bong bong combo. All right, that's stupid. I like the shotgun because I don't have to bother to aim. My aiming has gotten worse now that I've sat down. Oh, I'm dead. <sighs> well, that was certainly a thing. Uh, let's play it for another 10 minutes, see how it goes. I guess you guys ain't figured out let's no good for you. I'm supposed to swipe at that. That's tough. Jumping over the bar again. Real bad way about ah, that's the ticket. Did he really say that's the ticket? Like, 
like he's John Lovitz or something. Yes, yes, the door can stop Tony because you're an idiot. He Keep it down, ran right? down the other direction. Cool. Nope, nope, supposed to swipe. I guess I could have uh, shot him. Huh. Slapping them is... Almost as effective as shooting them for some reason. Alright, still don't have to break the thing. Oh, look! It's at least got bullet holes in it because it's losing all the water. Yep, I'm gonna shoot you out. Sure. That looks like where they take the quality rooms. How do I switch to the other gun? Shrouded mystery, but according to my number one informant, Jim Blancic. His informant is Wikipedia. Full of murder, craft, and theft. While his twin brother Kim Bong was feared from east to west as a killer of young and old and girls. Ah. Oh, so these are the real hard cases, huh? How do I switch guns? Okay, well that's cool. The bonuses are at least kind of funny. It's not a terrible on real shooter, but it's not spectacular by any stretch of the imagination. It's a little on the uh, simplistic side, but it's definitely interesting with the whole aiming with the motion of the controller. Oh. Swiping bit gets annoying though. Finding stuff to. Uh, She's still uh, flopping along to get out here, huh? Yeah, I've tried the D-pad to switch guns. It's not. It doesn't do anything. Busty Rosenblatt. I think I worked her bat mitzvah. Ugh. Fifi LaVolva, Apple Adams, Tony X girlfriend, not a friend, not a girl. Apple Adams, that makes sense. Good, let's have uh, gender dysphoria in the game too. That's, this game is there you are, not for the easily offended. Jerry Pops was the very definition of a femme fatale, feminine and, you know, fatale. The kind of dame who inspired uh, blood Roy Devine Jr. is an idiot. Twisting men's hearts till their pockets were empty and their eyes were full of lust. Didn't matter if they were rich, powerful... She's on the cover of every issue, I think, but, like, a barely a character in the comic. Comics of 12-issue series that they said was season one. Season two has never happened. 
I'm only guessing that this game is season two. Oh, so it's a Kim Jong Il uh, parody, kind of. Okay, that's stupid. You're here, Tony. The Seek Brothers goons jumped me outside the smoking barrel just before my shift. I thought I'd never escape. Well, the day's still coming out of your check. So what's with the hardware? Is something wrong? We need something wrong. Ain't you heard the fire and smoke? Uh, well, you were in the dance dance revolution. I had to take out well, a they... specific rim trying to rescue me. Well, let's let's reference two things at once. Specific rim and DDR. None of which probably allowed for any of the licensing for that. <laughs> All right, well, that was the first impression of Blue Estate, the game. Uh, yeah, that was about worth the three and a half bucks I paid for it. It's not spectacular by any stretch of the imagination, but it's entertaining. I, you know what, from what I hear, you can beat it in two hours. And then after beating it in two hours, it opens up another campaign where you play as another character from the comic, a Hitman. Apparently his story is a lot better because he's a more likable character. Tony, the guy you play as in, in this first level, is a bag of shit. All right, well, thanks for joining me for First D Impressions on Blue Estate. Uh, I will be right back to do Rogue Trooper. Today is all comic book games. Yay! And uh, we'll be back with Rogue Trooper in a minute or so. So uh, thanks for hanging out, and I hope to see you at the next stream in a minute or so. Thanks. Bye!